So if I am right, so I can start. Means I will be continue in the text eleven. So last time we say that in in the absence of a spiritual master, our progress, not only our progress, I think. It's my belief that any human being progress is not possible after taking birth as a human being in the absence of a spiritual master. A spiritual master means a real spiritual master. I see all these things in the context of in any religion doesn't matter. But that spiritual master should be a real spiritual master. Real means to show the real path. What is really good for us? So many different things has been written in the different religion scriptures. But the teaching that brings humility, that brings kindness, that increase love the entire creation of the god i think this teaching is a real teaching and moreover real spiritual master presents brings us not only this level more than this what is beyond our imagination what is beyond our thinking what is beyond our knowledge we know something but sometimes this crazy human mind pushes us to understand this we know everything it is really not So, Nanda Maharaj also thinking in the presence of Gargamuni, there's as much benefit he can get, should get. Actually, scriptures, whatever the leelas are there, God Bhagwan is Atma Ram, Apt Kam, He is Poon, Om Poon Madha Poon Vidam Poon Ad Poon Mudachate Poon Asa Poon Madha Poon Meva Vashishate. He is Purna, he is completely no need. But this is his unconditional mercy. That he wants that my Jeeva has been separate for the short while. So this, the presence of all these scriptures is because of all this that the coming people the people who will completely be in ignorance. How they will know the things. So he performed all this Leela. That our mind through these all Leelas and scriptures and teachings should be there. And time by time sending the bona fide spiritual master on this in this material world teach that this is not the limit only. Material is not the goal. Material enjoyment cannot be your goal. What is your real goal that can give you eternal happiness, a blissful situation in your life. With the connection by your daily practice to connect you and to understand what is your actual form to reach over there, go to back in the service of their lotus feet.
अध्याय स्टार्ट टेक्स्ट इलेवन शिशुको वाच एवं संप्रार्थितो विप्र स्वच्छ कृषि में तक चकार नाम करनम गुड़ो रहसी बालायो हो शुभदेव को स्वामी कंटिन्यूड हैविंग दस बीन स्पेशली रिक्वेस्टेड बाय नंद महाराज टू डू दैट व्हिच ही ऑलरेडी डिजायर्ड टू डू गर्गमुनी परफॉर्म the name giving ceremony for krishna and balrama in a solitary place solitary place by solitary place is in the solitary place because we know that comes already is messengers and these people were already wandering around the where very but the on the mass basis on a very huge Type of auspicious ceremony is going on. Go and say there why it is all happening. So definitely, to hide to protect Krishna Balrama. <laughs> Actually, they are the protector of all. <laughs> But Nanda Maharaj is a father, so he was performing his duty, and uh, as per his duty. Was following the instruction of Gargamuni also, and he remember the advice of Vasudeva also that such and such thing can happen. So you need to be very careful. So because of this, they choose in a solitary place without any crowd, without any noise. Very silently they perform this ceremony. Text twelve, Sri Gargavacha. अयम ही रोहिणी पुत्रो रम्यन सुहृद गुण है आख्यास्ते नाम बलाधिक्या बलम विदु यदूना पृथक भावा संकर्षण मूषं तेपी गर्गमुनि से डिस्चाइड अबाउट बलराम द सन ऑफ रोहिणी विल गिव ऑल हैपीनेस टू to his relatives and friends by his transcendental qualities therefore he will be known as a rama and because he will manifest extraordinary bodily strength he will also be known as bala moreover because he unites two families vasudeva's family and the nand maharaj family he will be known as sankarshan sankarshan means taking from one place and putting somewhere So it happened with uh, our Balram Maharaj. Now in Porpur, Baldeva was actually the son of Devaki, but he was transferred from Devaki's womb to that of Rohini. This fact was not disclosed. According to his statement in the Hari Bamsa, Pratyubacha Tato Rama, Pratyubacha Tato Rama, Sarvam Stan Abita Hastitam, Jada Veswa Api Sarveshu, Bhavanto Mamba Vallabha, Gargamuni did disclose to Nanda Maharaj. that balarama would be known as sankarshan because of uniting two families they do one sir and the bamsa nand maharaj one of which was known as kshatriya 
and the other as Vaishya. Actually, Nanda Maharaj is Vaishya and Vasudeva the Kshatriya. So here we see in the Varnasram, in Varna, Varnas, Varna arrangement, the unity of two families not new. It happened before also. Means, by this it is saying that the boundaries are not the limit. In Vaishnavism, there is no boundary. Vaishnav is Vaishnav. Both families had the same original forefather. The only difference being that Nanda Maharaj was born of a Vaishya wife, whereas Vasudeva was born of a Kshatriya wife. Later, so it is very clear over here. The mother of Nanda Maharaj was Vaishya and father was Kshatriya. The same thing with Vasudeva. The mother of Vasudeva was Kshatriya and father was Vaishya. Later, Nanda Maharaj married a Vaishya wife and Vasudeva married a Kshatriya wife. So although the families of Nanda Maharaj and Vasudeva both came from the same father, they were divided as Kshatriya and Vaishya. Now Baladeva united them and therefore he was known as Sankrishna because Baladeva took from uh, Devaki womb and transferred in the womb of Rohini. So this transformation is called Sankarshan. Means taking from somewhere and putting his skull. That's why his name is Sankarshan. Text 13. Asan Varanastreo Rasya Brinato Anu Yugam Tanuhu Shuklo Raktastata Pita Idanim Krishnam Idanim Krishnatam Gataha. Your son Krishna appears as an incarnation in every millennium. In the past, he assumed three different colors, white, red, and yellow. And now, he has appeared in the blackish color. In another Dwapar Yuga, he appeared as Lord Ramchandra in the color of Shuka, apparent. All such incarnations have now resembled in Krishna. That's why sometimes it is called the incarnation of Sri Krishna is Purna Avatar. Everything is last many incarnations, all qualities, all strength, all power, of all diplomatic ideas, all qualities, characteristics. This time, all these 
was included in Sri Krishna. So there is no nothing left. So he was in Purna Avatar. This incarnation was the pure, absolute and complete. Nothing is missing. All qualities are there. Passing in his purport, partially is explaining the position of Lord Krishna and partially covering the facts. It's very interesting. Gargamuni indicated your son is a great personality and he can change the color of his body in different ages. Why? Because he remember all his colors, past colors. It is possible. For him, nothing is impossible. So Gargamuni is already telling to Nanda Maharaj. The word Grihita indicates that Krishna is free. Grihita means he, he has, he, he took already, he keeping. He says, he says, depends upon his choice. Krishna is free to make his choice. In other words, he is the supreme personality of Godhead and may therefore do whatever he desires. Why? Because he, he wants to be happy and he also wants to make his associates happy. This is the nature. Loving and caring nature. Who cares? He definitely, how he care once cares. After caring, if someone is not happy, the caring is not success. Means the happiness is the result of caring. If you are caring, that person should be happy. And if that one someone is not happy, it means the someone is missing in your caring. But in Krishna, it is not like that. This is in our life. In Vedic literature, the different colors assumed by the personality of Godhead in different millenniums are stated. And therefore, when Gargamuni said, your son has assumed these colors, he directly said, no, sorry, he indirectly said, he is the Supreme Personality of Godhead. Gargamuni meaning of us, very clear. That he is able to do what he desires. Not only colors, anything whatever he desires, he is able to do. So automatically, he is the Supreme Personality. Because of Kamsa's atrocities, Gargamuni tried to avoid disclosing this fact. But indirectly informed Nanda Maharaj that Krishna, his son, is the Supreme Personality. Prabhupada Mohan is saying that it may be noted that Srila Jiva Goswami in his book Krama Sandarbha has enunciated the purport of this verse. In every millennium, Krishna appears in a different form. Either as white, red, or yellow. But this time, he personally appeared in his original 
blackish form and as predicted by gargamuni exhibited the power of narayan because in this form the supreme personality of godhead exhibits himself fully nothing left complete his name is shri krishna the all attractive attractive by by all sides not just by performing one leela killing the demons stealing butter going to school making madreshwara running after him all the fifty leaders actually Krishna is the source of all avatars, all incarnation, and therefore, all the different features of the different avatars are present in Krishna. That's why it's a purna avatar, the completeness of all incarnation. When Krishna incarnates. all the features of other incarnations are already present within him other incarnations are partial representations of krishna we are very fortunate who is the full fledged incarnation of the supreme being it is to be understood that the supreme being being whether appearing as shukla shukla means white rakta means red or pitta means yellow is the same person when he appears in different incarnations he appears in different colors just like the sunshine which contains seven colors might have been seen when it's a rainbow is there in the sky it indicates the color of the sun within it sometimes the colors of sunshine are represented separately many times we see in the sky separate color pink blue otherwise the sunshine is observed mainly as bright light the midday what is the color of sunshine nothing the brightness is there but we are not able to see the any color the different avatars such as the manavantara avatars leela avatars and das avatars are all included in the krishna avatar all this 24 different na we sing na devavare shesha loka pravesha nidra chadi उठ जीवा हरि हरि कृष्ण मुरारी राम कृष्ण हय ग्रीव दीज नेम्स ऑल ट्वेंटी फोर नेम्स आर देयर 
So these are also different 24 avatars. As we call Manavanta avatars, Leela avatars, Das avatars. Ram Krishna Hare Griva avatars, all this Hare Griva, all this Manavantara. After one separate Manavantara, it comes. When Krishna appears, all the avatars appears with him as described in Srimad Bhagavatam. Avatara haya asan kheya hareha sattva nirer dija yata bibhita sinavaha kulya sara sahasyu sahasra saha The avatars is incessantly appear like incessantly flowing water. No one can count how many waves there are in flowing water. And similarly, there is no limitation of avatars. And Krishna is the full representation of all avatars because he is the source of all avatars. That's why Sriman Mahaprabhu really uh, this uh, Mahamantra was in the absence of Mahaprabhu it was it will be never disclosed that why this mantra was before Hare Ram, Hare Ram, Ram Ram, Hare Hare, Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna. Krishna was coming later. But when Mahaprabhu came, then it disclosed very clearly that people will not understand, people will never know that who is Purna Avatar. Then he said, No, Hare Krishna. First, and even Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Rama even. Rama. Radha, Madhava, Radha, Moon. Not that Ram with bow and arrow. <laughs> this is chain. But even means, Purna means he established this mantra. Purna means Purna. Complete means what complete? If something comes enter in between the something different, then it is not complete. Complete means the entire meditation, the entire position should be Krishna's position. Ramati iti madhava, Radha Mohan, Rama, not that Rama who killed Ramana. Killing matter is not here. Here is Ananda, here is Rasa, there is Madhurya, full of love, full of Vatsalya. Third, power increasing program is there. <laughs> Muscle power increasing program is not there. <laughs> Heart power increasing program is Krishna is Amshi, whereas others are Amsha, part of Krishna. Part and partial. We think that we we are part and partial. No, Krishna's other avatars, Rama, Narsinga, Parshuram, Baraha, Maksya, Kachapa, Ayagriva, Rama, whatever. 
Buddha is the key. All part and partial of Krishna. If these avatars are part and partial of Krishna, we do. But is it, it, it is making completely clear. No doubt. That Krishna is supreme. It's Prabhupada is cutting our all doubts that we should fix ourselves. No deviation. Jai Jai Sri Radhe Jai Jai Sri Radhe Jai Jai Sri Radhe Meaning of this, meaning of this chanting, no deviation. <laughs> In the Rasa Sandarbha, we no need to deviate our mind even on only Krishna. This is, this is our goal. This is our prescriptions on this paper. The remedy, actual remedy, Radha Dasyam. Radha Dasi. Sri Radhike Dasatto. Descriptions and everything is following. But after coming Vrindavan, we, what we know, what we understand, what we learn with the help of our, our spiritual master. Radha Dasatto. Being a Radha Dasi is our real knowledge. Knowledge means in the process to go in the by the practice that how we will be, go back again. Back to God's head. Radhika. In our lotus feet. That's Dasi. <laughs> All living, in, including us, are amsas. Mame vansho jiva loke jiva bhuta sanatana ho, what we say in Srimad Bhagavad Gita. These amsas are of different magnitude. Human beings who are minute amsas. Means our, the duration of life is not countable. In the arrangement of this vast cosmic arrangement, we are minute amsas. And the demigods, Vishnu Tattva, and all other living beings are all part of the Supreme. Nityu Nityanam Chetanas Chetananam means his nit and awaken. The energy of awakening is present there, was still and will be in the future. Do this Chetan Tattva. Is always alive, meaning to say here. Krishna is the full representation of all living entities. And when Krishna is present, all avatars are included in him. The 11th canto of Srimad Bhagavatam describes the incarnations for each yuga in chronological order. The Bhagavatam says, Krite Shuklas Chaturbahu Tretayam Raktavarano So Dwapare Bhagavan Shyama and Krishna Varanam Tuiskranam Tuiskranam We actually see 
that in Kali Yuga, Bhagwan has appeared in Pitavar or a yellow color as Gaura Sundara. Although the Bhagavatam speaks of Krishna Varana, to adjust all these statements, one should understand that although in some yugas, some of the colors are prominent in every yuga, whenever Krishna appears, all the colors are present. We are knowing very well about Pitavara. Of the yellow color. What this yellow color indicates and why Suman so Mahaprabhu avatar becomes prominent After knowing, with the help of our spiritual master, when we came to know that what is the meaning of Sriman Mahaprabhu, but the things are hidden in this avatar. The Peeth word. or yellow color, or we can say golden color. We all know that what is this color is indicating. So here, but Srimad Bhagavatam is describing about yellow color. It's not very clearly we understood until we don't come in the mood of Vrindavan, in the mood of Gaudiya Parampara, in the mood of Navadyup Leela of Sriman Mahaprabhu. We have to enter over there and we'll try to understand about this yellow, peat or golden color. Krishna Varanam, Tvishakarshanam, although Chaitanya Mahaprabhu appears without Krishna, maybe Srila uh, Prabhupada also doesn't want to disclose like Gargamuni over here in his purport. So Chaitanya Mahaprabhu appears without Krishna or a blackish color. Srivan Mahaprabhu was not black, he was golden color. He is understood to be Krishna himself. Idanim Krishnatam Gataha. The same original Krishna who appears in different Varnas has now appeared. In Pita word. The word Asan indicates that he is always present. Asan means he was there. Not dead yesterday, he was not there. And in coming days, he will be not there. The word Asan indicates whenever the Supreme Personality of Godhead appears, in his full feature, he is understood to be Krishna Varana. Although he appears in different colors, Pralada Maharaj states 
दैट चैतन्य महाप्रभु इज चन्न दैट इज ऑल दो ही इज कृष्ण ही इज कवर्ड बाय ए येलो कलर Does the Gaudiya Vaishnavas accept the conclusion that although Chaitanya Mahaprabhu appeared in pita color, he is Krishna? Why this is hidden? Krishna Varanam, Tisha Krishna, Sangu Pangastra, Parsadam. यज्ञ संकीर्तन प्रेर कृष्णवर्णम त्रिश कृष्ण सांगोपांगस्त्र इट इज हियर इट इज बीन सेइंग अबाउट चैतन्य महाप्रभु यज्ञिया संकीर्तन प्रेर यज्ञाति ही सुमेर सह दो आर इंटेलेक्ट ओनली दे कैन अंडरस्टैंड दिस इंटेलेक्ट मीन्स हू गोज इन दिस सब्जेक्ट डीप एंड डीप डीप एंड डीप टेक्स्ट फोर्टीन प्राग्यम वसुदेव से क्वचिंचित क्वचिंचितस्तवात्मज वासुदेव इति श्रीमान विज्ञा संप्रचक्षते फॉर मैनी रीजन दिस ब्यूटिफुल सन ऑफ योर्स समटाइम्स अपीयर्ड प्रीवियसली एज द सन ऑफ वासुदेव गर्ग मुनि से आएगी देर फोर दो आर लर्न समटाइम्स कॉल दिस चाइल्ड वासुदेव गर्ग मुनि इनडायरेक्ट इनडायरेक्टली डिस्क्लोज दिस चाइल्ड वॉज ओरिजिनली बॉर्न एज द सन ऑफ वासुदेव Although this child born first appeared in the with four hands form, Narayan Vishnu was in front of Mother Devi. Although he is acting as your child, generally he is your child. but sometimes he is the son of vasudeva vasudeva and devaki were narayan bhakta actually narayan upasak so here sometimes he becomes the son of vasudeva i in this content but i understand when the power of narayana when this time of killing of some demoniac Like Sakta Sura, Sri Ramurtha, Utana. I think Krishna becomes the son of Vasudeva that time only. Other time, in his Bal Lila, he becomes the son of Nanda Maharaj, and Madhuri Shoda. Text fifteen. बहुनी संति नामानि रूपानि च सुतस्यते गुण कर्माणु रूपानि तान्यहम वेदनो जनाः फॉर दिस सन ऑफ योर्स बलनामा कंक्लूडेड वेरी शॉर्टली बट कृष्णा यू सी हियर गर्गमो गर्गमुनि इज नॉट स्टॉपिंग वन आफ्टर अनदर इज ओपनिंग द फोल्डर्स 
बहुनी संति नामानी रूपानी चुतस्य थे गुण कर्माणु रूपानी तानि हम वेद नो जरा फॉर दिस सन ऑफ योर्स देर आर मेनी फॉर्म्स एंड नेम्स अकॉर्डिंग टू हिस ट्रांसेंडेंटल क्वालिटीज एंड एक्टिविटीज here the qualities are included with activities also that makes him poor these are known to me but people in general do not understand them no proper proper is disclosing all these the word bahuni The Lord has many names: Advaitam, Achyutam, Anadim, Ananta, Rupam, Adim, Purnam, Purusham, Nava, Yauvanamcha, Advait. There is no duality. Achyutam, Anadim. Since when? Not known. Ananta, Rupam. There is no one form. That's why it is said sometimes, "Jit dekho tit sham mein anant roopa." Where we will say that he is not present. That's why it said in Vaishnavism, boundaries has no limit. All boundaries are broken when Vaishnavism walks. That's why the movement of this Prabhu Pada broken all the boundaries of this material world and entered in each and tried to enter it in each and every house. It is proven. Anantarupam, Adyam, Purna Purusham, Nava Yavanam Cha. Every day new. New, new manufacturing is is not becoming old. किशोर नित्य किशोर नित्य किशोरी दे आर नॉट ग्रोइंग और दे आर नॉट गोइंग डाउन नित्य एवरी डे यू सींग द सेम और देन समथिंग न्यू माई गॉड टू जर लुकिंग मोर न्यू मोर यंग मोर यंग as is stated in sri brahma samhita the lord is one but he has many forms and many names it was not that because gargamuni gave the child the name krishna that was his only name he has other names such as bhaktavatsala many cares devotees when he established his intimate relation with devotees it becomes bhaktavatsala always caring about devotees giridhari when he holds this hill then he becomes giridhari govind and gopal when he take care of cows So this associates the name becomes Gopal, Govind. When he controls our all activities under his guidance, and he becomes Govind. If we analyze the Nirukuti, the Nirukuti or semantic semantic derivation. Of the word Krishna, we find 
that no signifies that he stops the repetition of birth and death. Mm. Wow. Nirukti. When we will analyze this word or the semantic derivation of the word Krishna, we find that no in Nirukti, the word, the letter is no signifies that he stops the repetition of birth and death. And Chris means Sattarth or existence he is there, is present, was, now, and will be. Krishna is the whole of existence. Also, Chris means attraction, pulling our heart. And no means ananda or bliss. Krishna known as Mukunda because he wants to give everyone a spiritual, eternal, blissful life. Very beautiful. He wants to give. We are lacking somewhere. We are doubtful. Go internal or not? What will happen? What is this? Oh. Should or should not? Should or should not? We are doubtful. He wants to give. What? A spiritual, eternal, blissful life to us. Unfortunately, because of the living entity, entity's little independence, the living entity wants to deprogram the program of Krishna. We have our many programs in this material world. So we forget what he programmed for us. On computer programming is there, no? So we, we set our programming in this device. In this life, it's like computer, if we see, that we fixed many different programs by our choices, we think that we are doing. This is a problem. We deprogrammed de what is programmed and we fix our programming. Our programming becomes fast, fast programming. Bar five, very, my God, dynamic, excellent, intelligent. Extraordinary. All these beautiful dictionaries, words, putting on with our personality. Forgotten. That what is his program? This is called material disease. Prabhupada is writing here. Showing that in a material, it's by your choice. The placement of diseases are there. Careful. 
That's why it is always said to make balance. Understand first material. What this material will give you. And the chose only essential just to survive. But apply only what is 100% necessary for you. For your eternal form, what actually you are. So, the material corners are full of different kind of diseases that can make you only, can give you only sickness. That's why Prabhupada is saying that material disease. Nonetheless, because Krishna wants to give transcendental bliss to the living entities. He appears in various forms. That's why he is called Krishna. In every form he attract, attracted to devotee. That's why the number, the list of his devotees is also very big. But in Krishna, it's completely, he did not let anyone to move anywhere. Where are you going? Where are you going? Come. He pulled everyone. Is it at attraction? No need to go anywhere. And as a result, these beautiful scriptures are with us by the help of all these scriptures we, we can understand very easily. Because Gargamani was an astrologer, he knew what others did not know. Yet Krishna has so many names that even Gargamanis did not know them all. Completely he is also not knowing. It is to be concluded that Krishna according to his transcendental activities has many names and many forms. Text 16. Esa was rare Adhyasya Gop Gokulanandanaha Anen Sarvadurgani Yamanjas Stari Shatha. Esava Shreya Adhyasya Gop Gokul Nandanaha Anil Sar Durgani Yuya Manjas Tarishyata to increase the transcendental bliss of the coward man Gokula. This child will always act auspiciously for you. And by His grace only, you will surpass all difficulties. That's why it said, fix yourself at one. Ek sadhe sab sadhe, sab sadhe sab jai. In a Indian saying, it is that, if you are running many places, not a single will come to you. But if you are practicing on one, all will come to you. This is Krishna. This is Radharani. Ek sadhe sab sadhe. Fix yourself at one. Don't run. Many demigod and goddesses. Little to Ganesha, little to 
Kartike, little to Rashmi, little to Rim, little to Rim. Okay, they are there. They are worshipable for different, different. But why we Vaishnava need to run many places? No. He is there. He is saying, I am there. You no know, need to jump at different places. No need to jump. This is the same. Now, Prabhupada's purport for the coward name and the cause, Krishna is the supreme friend. Therefore, he is worshipped by the prayer Namo Brahma, Namo Brahmanaya Devaya, Go Brahmana Hitaya Cha. His pastimes in Gokula, his Dhamma are always favorable to the Brahmanas and the cows. His first business is to give all comfort to the cows and the brahmanas. In fact, comfort for the brahmanas is secondary and comfort for the cows is his first concern. That's why before Brahmin, cows are very important. This is the new thing I came to know. Now we can understand how important is the cow in our tradition. Direct connection of Sri Krishna was putting the tilak on the cow. Definitely it is written here. Namo Brahmanaya Devaya Gu Brahmanaya Hitaya Cha. Cow is important. The second number is Brahman. Because of his presence, all people would overcome all difficulties and always be situated in transcendental bliss. In the Gokula, he was there and cows were there. There was no significance of Brahmanas over there. He been with the cow. And he got all the difficulties of Gokulvasi. And later on, Nandagao Vasi. So, in the today's conclusion, the name ceremony performed very nicely. And we came to know many beautiful things. Myself, I also came to know. I just was reading for you. So, we can feel while listening or reading the sweetness of pastimes of Sri Krishna, the sweetness of this yuga. So, since when we came in the different rasa, with the help of our spiritual master, after reading these two beautiful scriptures, Sri Sri Vilakus Mandali and Sri Sri Radharas Mandali, I didn't listen much, but whatever I listened, it became a greed house for me. These words, the sentences became
to make me greedy to listen more and more about these sweet pastimes. And they are pulling really me. Shrimad Bhagavatam, I can say this is surplusing the knowledge to adding in these two sweet scripture to mixing the sweetness of Srimad Bhagavatam with the sweetness of Radha Rasa Sudhanidhi Sri Sri Radha Rasa Sudhanidhi and Sri Sri Vilap Kusumajini. That's why while reading my mood goes on the sweetness of these two scriptures that is really hidden, not for all, for Rasikas. And that's why these Leelas are not out of never. Yeah, separately, under the guidance of his spiritual master, we are able to read or share or discuss. But it's openly, these are only for Rasikas. Like we, we know what is the meaning of Rasa. Those who are understanding the meaning of rasa, these scriptures are for them actually. Really, when the rasikas listen this, they enjoy this, they live in this, they go deep and they become eternally, eternal happiness is there. So they go more deep and deep and they enjoy a lot. In some sentences, it happened also with me that I can, it's not the things to say that, it's like that picture is moving in front of my eyes and the things are happening and looking their happiness, the yugala's happiness, how happy they are, how nicely they are performing this sweet pastime in Nikonja. My God, then it is it's totally becomes unbelievable. And then the feeling comes about these scriptures. If these scriptures were not there, we, we, will, we were able to do know something, but I think the darkness removes after reading these two sweet scriptures. The darkness means until you are not tasting this sweet leelas and feeling yourself that how much they are happy with all this pastime. Of course, I am also present there with the Swaroop given by my Gurudev under this Siddha Pranali. Feeling that I am also one of the Dasi over there. Becoming the witness all this Leela. And from the heart is melting and the heart is enjoying so much of this nectar, relishing. And this total Environment is totally different for us. Thank you very much for today. I will try to be continue on my little this uh, as a schedule that to be again share with you to read for you as well as for you and as more important for me. Your presence is important for me. Because uh, with your presence, whatever intellects come in this mind, this is not mine, this is yours. And I'm able to say something. And just I'm reading for you that the, to make the connection should continue. And more and more and more and more and more slowly, slowly, this connection becomes deeper with this deepness, this tiredness, without any tiny hole, should be there. 
that we can continue. Maybe in this life, by the grace of the mercy of Sumadhi Radhika, will by our mercy if you accept us. You may have dasatto among the other dasat dances, where is our position? <laughs> if she likes, it's all different for her. So thank you very much. Jai Jai Sri Radhe Jai Jai Sri Radhe Jai Jai Sri Radhe. Thank you very much. Next time again with you in this beautiful moment. Thank you, my dear family. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> I was waiting for you to start talking for years. <laughs> you know, it's very hard to say for us that we're not born in this Indian culture to hear from someone who is born in this culture, it's like, wow. <laughs> our culture is the same. Our culture is, Rasa culture is there. So we are, yeah. we become one. After yes. This. <laughs> you know, you are, you are old like us here, but all your life, you were, by mercy of Radha, you were under this influence. This or that. But, all your life you were feed fed by this you know by by this culture yeah. so it's different it's than us this is this is also even because of the radharani's mercy 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 yeah yeah who knows that my previous life maybe in europe or somewhere who knows, <laughs> yeah, who knows? Who knows? but this life wow <laughs> <laughs> i don't know who so this, this is possible <laughs> But fortunately, Marci came and I took birth in India. Uh, yeah. Near Gurudev's family. Uh. <laughs> More or later, came to Vrindavan to understand why Gurudev is there, why he's there, why this family is connected with Vaishnavism. Mm -hmm. And came to Vrindavan. This is this is unconditional love and Krishna mercy of Sumati Radhika. So I'm very... What I can thank them, I cannot thank them because... I this my tongue is not as much pure even to thank them. So <laughs> I cannot thank Srimad Radhika or what what I can I cannot say the thing. I'm under their <laughs> toll that they put their feet on my head and then smash my this dirty <laughs> head and make my new form and then give a chance to be you pure devotee to be with you people. So yeah, I can you know. and try to change my family. Thank you very much.